नमस्कार वी नीड टू रिमेन फिट द मोस्ट मार्वलस थिंग्स अबाउट ह्यूम इज दैट वी आर ऑल डिफरेंट फ्रॉम ईच अदर एवरी वन इज यूनिक इन सो मैनी वेज एट फिजिकल लेवल मेंटल लेवल इमोशनल लेवल स्पिरिचुअल लेवल सो इट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट टू फाइंड आउट अबाउट आर सेल्स हाउ टू स्टे फिट एंड हेल्थी good health is one of the priorities of our life because it is our swadharma our duty towards ourselves if we are fit and healthy we do not face the miseries of sickness and pain maharshi patanjali advises heyam dukham managatam this sutra comes in second chapter of patanjali's yoga sutra it is number 16 pain which is yet to come could be avoided the important point which is mentioned here is that we should live in present so that you can avoid any suffering that may come to you now you may ask how can i live like this you have so many choices every day about how you should live while doing so you should be mindful about your age your limitations and your behavior with others we'll give you seven tips here i would like to highlight seven ways that you may choose to stay fit healthy and contented one if you are a normal healthy person once in a month observe fruit day and eat only fruit to give rest to your digestive system and improve your metabolism depending on the season there are varieties of fruits available fruits are easily digestible and generate energy and alertness second water is most important element because your body also is made up of around 60% of water experts always advise you to drink sufficient water every day now if you want to make this habit more interesting twice in a day drink warm water with pinch of salt and lemon this will detox your system naturally at regular interval third to be fit and healthy we have to be active and use our muscular and skeletal system once a day practice yoga asanas which stretches your spine in six different ways upward sideward bending forward and backward bending twisting and inwards these asanas strengthen the muscles of your spine and improve your posture fourth breathe twice a day sit or stand with your shoulders relaxed and then inhale for three counts and exhale for three counts practice four rounds of this breathing rhythm this kind of breathing is called as equal breathing and it has a power to dramatically change your emotional state by inducing calmness within seconds fifth take a break from the constant chatter of your mind for 10 minutes every day by sitting comfortably in a quiet place preferably in an open nature close your eyes make your spine straight relax your shoulders and passively observe your breathing just observe without exaggerating your breathing pattern you will experience that gradually and gradually your breathing will become rhythmic and your mind relax sixth in your daily schedule make it a point to give 10 minutes every day attend to the potted plants decorate your windows try some new recipes this will rejuvenate your whole being and you will find more creative ways to express yourself seventh once a week involve yourself in some selfless voluntary activities like helping the elderly cooking food for someone who is sick teaching under privileged children If you look around you will find plenty of such opportunities this will help you to develop empathy for other people and definitely make you a better person follow these seven ways and discover a better and fitter version of yourself you will see that the time that you devote to these activities will enrich you in many ways and finally learn to be grateful for all the blessings that you have received in this life namaskar